Our motoring tip of the week concerns tires. I loaned my van out to a buddy the other day and half an hour after he drops it back at my place, I walk by it and I see the sidewall of the tire is all scuffed and abraded. The wheel cover has got a big crunch mark on it and it's pounded in behind the lip of the rim. So I take the wheel cover off, straighten it out, pop it back out where it's supposed to be and I can see this big abrasion on the sidewall. Now, luckily it didn't do any damage to the tire, but if you're in the habit of constantly crunching your right side tires into curbs and any objects that are in your way, it's a really bad habit and eventually you're going to do some damage to the tire. Now, the tread of the tire on this particular tire is five plies. The sidewall on this one happens to be two plies, but most passenger car tires, a lot of them, are only one ply in the sidewall. And the uh, sidewall plies run in this direction, in the radial direction. So if you jam an object up against the side of it, you can spread them apart and damage the sidewall of the tire. The tire may not actually blow or rupture, but you'll, you'll oftentimes find a wave or a bulge in the side of the tire that corresponds with that abrasion mark that you just put on the tire from hammering it into that obstacle, whatever it is. So you need to be more careful when you're parking your car and a better practice is to back the car in because you can often look in the passenger side mirror and see the curb and square yourself up with the curb and go nice and slowly so that if you do brush it, you can reverse and take the pressure off the tire. There's no light duty tire that was ever designed to be crunched into obstacles without the possibility of some damage. Now, if you're talking about all-terrain tires on pickup trucks and off-road trucks, it's a different story. They're designed in a much more robust fashion with reinforcement to the sidewall to possibly get you past those obstacles. But if you push your luck hard enough with those, you can rupture them as well. So be a little bit more careful about how you use your vehicle. Remember, you can put the tread of the tire over the obstacle, but not the sidewall. That's your motoring tip of the week.